Greetings Space Cadets. Today we're starting another brand new series. Loot Crate have now started doing gaming crates. So now we're going to do Loot Gaming, which is another monthly series, uh, as opposed to the Firefly one, which is every other month, which you can also see videos for. But enough of that, let's have a look inside. Uh, the first one is Legacy. So I expect some old game, old gaming related uh, merchandise in here. So let's have a look. Uh, yeah, some old castle type backgrounds there from uh, some of the old classic games. Um, let's see what we've got. A t-shirt. Uh, I wonder if we're going to get a t-shirt every month with these ones as well. Um, so we've got a t-shirt with all all of the Mario characters there. I'll put a better picture up of that online as well. Let's pop that to one side. And what else are we getting with uh, gaming themed? Um, ooh, I've got a few things dropping out there. Looks like quite a lot of um, like fabric you close sort of stuff, but let's have a look at this uh, figure first. If we can focus on that there, perhaps. Yep, yeah, there we go. So who's this one? Heroes of the Storm. Um, never heard of it, but we'll take a look and see what we get. Because I'm not fighting with the packaging this time. Let's uh, cut up with this. This will be on all day. <laughs> That's quite nice, that actually. Let's put some focus on that there. Uh, I'm trying to remember what that what that reminds me of. I can't think of the game. Um, nope, it's completely gone. Does it say on here what his name is? No, nope, I can't even see. I can't even see that character on there. Unless it's supposed to be this guy here. It's, uh, is that a red variant on the bottom? So it could have been like a Captain America style. Um, yeah, that's obviously this guy here. But, uh, yeah, don't know what it is, but it does remind me of something. But I can't think what I can't think what the game is now. It'll come to us later. That or if you guys know, put it in the comments below there. But, uh, let's pop that to one side. Get the cutty thing out of the way. And what have we got? This looks like socks. Uh, let's have a look. It says Skyrim on it, so it's Skyrim socks. So it's just socks with the. Uh, with the logo on. Anything different on there? No, it's just uh, on the other side as well. There's just the, the Skyrim logo there. Um, so yeah, it's a little bit disappointing. I would have thought a little bit more, a little bit different for the gaming related products. Um, let's pop that to one side and see what else there is because there's something else fabric here. Uh, exclusive Master Chief Scarf. So they've gone for basically all clothes in this one, all clothes in a figure. Let's, uh, let's see if we can pop this open. And have a look. Uh, ooh, what else is this? Oh, so it's a, uh, a scarf and hoodie. So we've got the, the Master Chief green, and um, you can see his uh, the Master Chief helmet from his uh, Millionaire armor. <laughs> but, uh, I suppose that's quite nice. Um, that might be something fun, <laughs> something fun to wear if I'm at uh, Comic Con in the winter. <laughs> Uh, anything down there and the rest of the sleeves is just the the rest of the armor and that uh, pattern that you see on all the all the master chief stuff but, uh, right, let's pop that to one side that's uh, not too bad even though it does seem to be very everything seems to be close and uh, what have we got here street fighter let's see if we can focus on that there there we go um right it's a uh, exclusive uh, pin of some sort you know, that reminds me of because um, I don't really know much about Street Fighter. I don't play those uh, those particular games. If we can focus on that there. It looks more like something you would get uh, from the Expendables movies. Uh, all right, that's why it won't come off because it's pinned. One, two. Let's see if I can do this without stabbing myself. So, there we go. Yeah. I would expect that to be something more. The Expendables. Uh, let's see. If we can focus, possibly. Yeah, there we go. Still getting used to this new camera. There, we have to buy, I think, a macro lens so that we can look really close because we can't uh, can't focus like that. <laughs> Never mind. But, uh, yeah, that's alright. If it uh, 
feels a bit cheap. Um, but yeah, that's, that's all right there. I think I would rather think of that as something from the Expendables because I don't really don't really play that sort of fighting game. And what have we got here? We've got our Legacy Pin because of course they're doing these much better pins uh, this year for uh, got all the loot crates. We've all got a, a lot better pins. So uh, yeah, that's that one there. And is there anything else? We've got the um, the magazine that you get for all the loot crates, but this one's done in the style of the old manuals that you used to get with all your games, because it used to be this sort of like thin, thin one, quite thick card. The views on this one. Let's see anything else in there. It's got the uh, collectible pin, Master Chief scarf, and just a few bits and bobs. Not really that much content in uh, in that one, or, or in fact that much content in the the crate itself. Um, this is the first gaming crate. I just hope that they're going to be a little bit more, a little bit more substantial. I mean, as that this guy is looks pretty cool. Uh, I'll put some better pictures of him on my website. Uh, it seems to be just mostly all clothing items, and um, the sort of stuff that you would get is um, in the accessory section at game, perhaps. But, um, there we go. We'll see how these ones go. So we'll give them a go for a couple of months. If they if they don't pan out to be very good, then we'll we'll end them there. Um, but don't forget to rate, comment, favourite and subscribe if you'd like your own loot crate. Just follow the link in the description below. You'll be able to check out more photos from this set and all the other sets on my website. Plus all the other loot crate unboxings, the regular loot, uh, loot crates, the special loot crates, the Firefly loot crates as well. And the gaming ones. But uh, hopefully hopefully there'll be a little bit of an improvement because the, the first one's not really, not really that good to be honest. <laughs> but never mind. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time.